Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Christine. Today I am going to do my travel makeup case. This is from Walmart. I bought this. It was $20 or $19.99 in Walmart Canadian price. Okay, it's one of those that you open just like this. You cinch it in or you can cinch it out with these here. And you, I like this one because you can see everything in there. So you can make it as wide, wide as you want or small as you want. But I like to just spread everything on the counter just like that. And in here I have my Sephora case um, for my brushes. This had their own brushes in there but I went ahead and took it out and put my own. What I like to do so this part doesn't get dirty with the dirty makeup brushes, I put one of these. Um, and then afterwards, after I use this, when I get back home, I wash them. And when it dries, I put it back in here. So here I have just my essential brushes. I don't take extra ones, just whatever I need, that's what I take. So I have my, you know, like eye brushes and powder brushes and blush. So just pretty much everything this I love to use is for my crease. This is from Morphe, just like that. So it's more defined. This is the M149. Not sure if it's gonna catch it, but here you go. Just like that. And this was really inexpensive as well to get. I have my NYX. This one they don't make anymore. It's the felt tip liner, but this one I really like. This is a dupe for um, Kat Von D one. And much cheaper, but obviously they don't make it anymore. I have some lower lash liner. I use them once in a while, but lately I haven't been doing that. And my eye, for my eyebrows. And let's see. Yeah, that's pretty much it. My lip liner. And this is just a neutral one. This one's from Avon that I got a while back and it's, I can't even see the name here. I think it's what, it just says neutral on it. So looks like that. And again with these, I sharpen them if I need to. What I like to do is, if, so I don't forget, is whatever I need, to have put back in here, I'll go ahead and put it in my to-do list. So let's say I'm, I'm running out low of my, um, just crazy example, of my sunscreen. So I would put pack sunscreen. So whatever I need to put back in my travel case or whatnot, my backpack, I just put it in here. So when I get back, I know what I need to put in. Just so I'm like, what did I, Rem you know, like I can't remember when I get back. So that's what I like to do. And I have this one. This is for, I use this for my makeup sometimes or my hair. Right there. This is the Clairol in dark brown. And a big mirror like this. Like that, just so you get an idea. I also have, so I'm just looking at it like this. <laughs> it's all spread. I like to put them in the bag just because the powder sometimes, I've had a few times where it broke. And since I had it in here, it doesn't ruin all my stuff. And that's why I have it in these Ziploc bags. I have, this is old. I don't think they make this anymore because I've checked and they don't. It's the Fit Me Blush from Maybelline Medium Coral. Looks like this. I have the True Match Powder. This one is W3 New Beige. Like that. Essence Highlighter, Be My Light. With this one, I went ahead and put the little you know, like a little cotton pad in there. It looks like that just in case it that doesn't break on me. I have one of these translucent powder. 
and it is from Tarte. So it just looks like this. This one was um, from Avon. It's Crushed Berry. I've had this for a long time. It's one of those, I like to put on my makeup. So before I put on my powder blush, I put this on. So to make it last longer, that's what I like to do. I also have lipstick from, this is from Ble Blush Ripple is what it's called, from Burt's Bees. This one, typically I was like, no, this is not my color I like, but surprisingly, I like it. It looks like this, like that. And this one, again, they, they repackaged this a long time ago, so you see how old it is. But this I use for my, um, for bronzing. And sometimes I use it for my eyeshadow as well. So this is Tawny. It looks like this. I think they still make this, but I'm not 100% sure. Because I, when they had it on clearance, I bought a bunch of them because I knew I was going to use it. And this one I love so much. This is Rich. And it's Mineral Stick Foundation from NYX. So it's a foundation, but what I like to use this as is a bronze stick. Again, same thing. So before I put my powder bronzer, I would use this. So I put it here, right here, and on my nose to um, give me more of a chiseled look for bronzing. And I have a mirror. This one, obviously, I haven't used, but it's there. I have this, instead of using my um, Milani eyeshadow primer, which has to go in my 311 liquid bag, I just use this instead so I don't have to put it in there. And I have my other, this is CoverGirl. Have it in here the little bag it came from I got this from Amazon but this is the peach punch and it smells like peach just like that so I might just take this out since I have my Nervina in here like I showed you if you watch my other video but here it is I put it in here as well I just don't want to ruin the <laughs> the box oh I know I know that's just me that's how I work. And this one is the Tatcha, the silk canvas. This is a travel size that I got for free when you purchase $25 or more. So I got this and I thought it's perfect instead of having my, um, the ones that you have to put in your 311 bag. This one is solid primer, just like that. And that's what I use for it. And I need to do a video about that too, of my, the stuff that you can, instead of having your um, liquid stuff, where you can purchase the solid items to put in here. Okay, and that, yep. Yeah. What else do I have in here? Let me see if there's little pockets of some sort in here. Oh yeah, see? There's a little pocket in here. There's just one little pocket. In there, I have a sharpener. It's a Clinique sharpener that's sitting there. Looks like I haven't used it, but it's there just in case. So that concludes my video. Hopefully you guys find this helpful. Please give me a thumbs up. And also, if I've forgotten something that you guys take, let me know. That would be helpful for me too. So don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you later. Bye. Okay, I'm back again. I didn't realize there was another little pocket in here. While I was trying to put these things away, there's a little pocket in here as well. I have nail file in here that I got at Dollar Tree. My tweezer. This one I got from where did I get this from? Um, Canadian Superstore. So it's a grocery store and they got like other stuff in there and nail clippers just in case. Sometimes I get this crazy cuticle that's just stuck in there and it's like 
it drives me nuts. So I have this in there. And also I noticed I've forgotten about this. So instead of get, grabbing the beauty blender, I use this for traveling. So it's one of those for your foundation and then you put your foundation on and then you slap it like that. Okay, so now this time I'm going and I will see you soon. Bye.